Did you know that the largest planet in the solar system can fit 1,321 Earths inside of it? Today we're going to run some planetary simulations to give you an idea of just how big some planets really are. It's going to be mind-blowing. Let's start with the smallest planet, Mercury. It's too small to fit even one Earth inside of it, but it can hold a moon or two. Mercury can fit almost two of our moons inside of it, and our moon isn't even the smallest moon in the solar system. We've got Europa, Triton, Titania, Enceladus, there's a lot of options. And even though Pluto isn't a moon, well, it's not a planet either, so I'll add it to the list as well. Mercury can fit almost three Europas, five Plutos, 29 Titanias, that's the moon of Uranus, if you were wondering. This is Enceladus. This tiny moon of Saturn is only 500 kilometers in diameter, and you would need 906 of them to fill up Mercury. But enough about Mercury, let's move up to Mars. Mars is not as large as Earth, it's more like half of an Earth. It could hold two Mercuries inside. It could also fit seven moons. Or a whole lot of Plutos. Next up, Venus. It's still not big enough to fit Earth, but it's close, so close. Venus is almost as big as Earth. It can hold 15 Mercuries, not bad. Venus can even hold the largest moon in the solar system, Ganymede. Ganymede is the moon of Jupiter, and it's even bigger than Mercury. By the way, Earth itself can fit 49 moons inside of it. Finally, a planet that can fit Earth, well, actually 57 Earths. Neptune is the smallest ice giant on the block, but it's still huge it could fit 67 Venuses. Uranus is only slightly larger than Neptune. It can fit one Neptune inside of it. Uranus can hold 63 Earths, and even more Venuses, or almost 10,000 Plutos. Now, if you think Uranus is huge, well, Saturn is enormously gigantic. 
12 Uranuses would fit inside it. Slightly more Neptunes. As for Earth, well, you could cram 763 of us inside a Saturn. and 90 Venuses, 13,000 Mercuries, or over 100,000 Plutos. Incredible! But wait till you see the largest, most gigantic planet in the solar system, Jupiter. Jupiter is so large it could swallow a whole Saturn, or 20 Uranuses, or 22 Neptunes. When it comes to the smaller, rocky planets, those numbers go way up. Are you ready for it? and 21 Earths can fit inside of Jupiter. That's a lot of Earths. And even more Venuses. Many more Marses. Mercuries? You'd need over 20,000 of them. And as for we Pluto? Well, you could stuff 203,000 Plutos inside Jupiter. So, some planets are way too small to cram Earth inside of them, and some planets are so gigantic that you'd have to copy Earth 1,300 times to fill them up. Oh, and the Sun? Well, the Sun is the absolute king, the heavyweight champion of our planetary neighborhood. It's enormous! It can hold 988 Jupiters inside of it. And 1,305,693 Earths. Let that number sink in for a minute. Okay, that's long enough. What do you think we should compare next? How about comparing how each planet would kill you if you landed on it? Well, that's a story for another What If.